Welcome to Miami. Today we're going to be taking you on a South Beach cheap eats tour to some local spots. You know, I used to be able to afford to eat here, now things have changed. And today I'm being joined by my friend Diana. Diana. Hello, I am ready to eat. Yeah, you ready? <laughs> yes. Awesome. So we're going to hit up five spots, spend around $10 at each place, and we're starting off here at Las Colas Cafe. Yes, this is my favorite spot for so many years. They renovated, it's amazing, and let's see how much we spend right now. Let's do it. Let's go. What's cool about this place is they have a mix of all different types of Latin American cuisine. Yeah, I'm gonna have a pequeño, el pan de oro, and a corte. So you're eating? You're eating all of that? No. Okay. We're sharing. We're sharing. We're gonna eat a lot. Let's not do the same thing we did yesterday. I think we have to get sugar cane though. What apple? What apple the best? No, no, it's going to be over budget. Yeah, remember, it's $10. Un pequeño, un pan de bono, una corte. Yeah, and a corte. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, 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 I always try to like lower the sugar level. So this is a ventanita. This is a small window. This is how we do it in Miami. This is our street food. Yes, this is the style of Miami. You get served by the window. I, love it. I mean, if you want to go inside, sit down inside, it's different. But for fast pickup, this is the place. Yeah, you have their entire menu right here. Well, this is very affordable. They have a lot of great things for like two dollars. Yeah. So I don't even know where it's possible, but we'll see. Here? Right, yeah. That's right. Everywhere else is like 15, 13. Yeah. Like the green juice is like 13 dollars. And here we go. So we have two different street foods, one from Colombia, one from Venezuela. So what is pan de bono? Pan de bono is made out of dough and a lot of cheese and it's very flattening, but it tastes delicious and we eat it for breakfast. Yeah, so the gueño, this is like a snack throughout Venezuela at weddings. They have them very small ones, these probably a million of them. And this, watch this. So there's cheese inside. This is basically a cheese stick. And you have to eat it like right when it comes out of the fryer. So it's nice and gooey. Alright, let's try it. Mm -hmm. Nice dough. Mm -hmm. No, I need this whole thing. No, I'm a pequeño addict. Oh, because that was like a monster. Pan de bono. Oh my god, I love it. So this one has a little bit of cheese, right? It has a lot of cheese on it, Lots but it's already like mixed with the dough. Mm. Has a little sugar too. Mm -hmm. Tiny little bit. Yeah. What I like about the pan de bono is that it's sweeter than this one. It's just a nice cheese snack. Yeah. You eat it in weddings too? In weddings, they come with like a million. And then right here we have a cortadito, so this is like a quick shot, an espresso shot. 70% of this is coffee, 30% milk, and then you have some foam. And that's why I love this place, and that's why this place is my favorite one. Because they make the best cortaditos, and it's really like a dollar and ten cents. Yeah, the cost has gone up. It used to be like 40 cents. Well, I, I don't think I was here when it was 40 cents. I was here when it was like 75 cents. <laughs> Something like six dollars. Sorry, I'm still choking myself. <laughs> okay, so it's ten eighty-nine, so we passed it by just a little bit, and that was just two little small snacks. And coffee. Eighty-nine cents. Yeah. Gracias, amiga. Okay, let's go to the car. Next spot. Here we have south of 5th, and then from here to 17th is all South Beach. We're gonna make a left here, and we're going right now to Sandwichery to have a French sandwich. Woohoo! Second spot! Let's continue eating! Here we go, Sandwichery. Can we do one day that we just go to the gym and work out? Sí, sí, sí. 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 S
Está enamorado de una Ay, no digas eso ahora. Sí, tuve ahí como hace dos semanas. Ah, sí. Yo recomiendo el Italian o el Star Club. Y por poder agregar todo lo que está aquí. Yeah, but this is our budget. Our budget is ten dollars. So we have to pick from here. I think we should go French. It's like turkey and brie. Turkey and brie is good. Right, so you got ten dollars. Exactly. Then we tip rats on something. Oh, it doesn't show it. Print, print. Alright, so total price. And obviously I put a tip. Yes, of course. So this is turkey brie sandwich. Can't get more fresh than this, right? Brie cheese, we have tomatoes, we have lettuce, red onion. Do you love red onion? Yes, I do. I love it. It's amazing. Okay, so you know why this is really big? When you're eating this alone, you're going to have like half for your lunch or half for your dinner. So. Or just coming with a friend and share, right? Exactly. Yeah, I don't know how I'm gonna... Oh, we gotta bite this. The mass of sandwich. Mm -hmm. But we still have a few more spots. I think next we're gonna get some pizza. I think it's uh, one dollar. No, it's like fifteen dollar pizza. Wow. I'm definitely going to the gym after this. <laughs> ¿Cómo estás, amigo? ¿Todo bien? bien? Qué bueno. ¿Qué estás construyendo acá? ¿De queso? No, regular de queso, sí. sí. Regular de queso. No, no, 
it's massive. It's already. <laughs> okay, so this is the Hawaiian. So what do we have? Tomato, pineapple. What is that? Prosciutto? Ham? Ham? No, it's not prosciutto. It's ham. It looks like prosciutto, but it's it, ham. It looks like it. Uh, I mean, prosciutto is ham too, but okay, so. it's not. And uh, no, wait. Don't you want to put some of the... Um, I got the pepper flakes. Yeah, I like pepper flakes too. I love spicy food. Oh, spicy food. <laughs> I mean, I'm all about the peppers. You got out of your leg. Okay. So this is a massive pizza for seven sixty. Mm. Now, candy, that is. I said I was only gonna take a bite, but this is so good. Mm. I love the pineapple. I love it. So much on Okay. The bottom. Double cross. Amazing. Very nice bite. So guys, you can eat a lot of affordable food in South Beach still if you know where to go. I mean, everywhere we ate, ten dollars, one person, we eat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, this pizza is awesome. I like it. So it's a little fluffy, not super like deep dish like Chicago, but I, I like just the, the amount of topping on top, right? Total cost here, seven ninety five plus tax. Let's go, baby. One slice. Seven ninety five plus tax. So no tip. Hermano, gracias. Gracias. Remember, this is the original Pizza Rustica on 9th, right? 9th Street in uh, Washington. In oh, Washington. Awesome. All right, I don't know how much more I can eat, <laughs> but I'll try. <laughs> yeah. So next up, we're going to a place called Taquiza to have a Mexican taco. Let's go. No, that's not a I love this. By the way, Takiza is only like a block and a half away from La Sandwicherie, which we just ate at. That's right? awesome. Everything is just very close to each other. Yeah, we were just hanging out in the car. <laughs> <laughs> no, actually, we didn't even have to drive. <laughs> we did, we did. Yeah, it's really good that we stuck between 5th and 17th, right? So this is like real South Beach. And we're coming up on Collins. Collins Ave, Washington. Okay, so they have the menu right in front of us. We have uh, chicken, we have grasshoppers. That's what I'm getting. What are you getting? Chicken, of course. I'm chicken. not eating anything crazy today. <laughs> it's not so bad. So the chicken one's four dollars and fifty cents. The chapulines, grasshoppers, five fifty. So we're literally at the budget. <laughs> Got the chapulines and the pollo together with the jalapeno hot sauce right in there, right? It's very spicy. It is medium spicy. If anything, it goes very well with both of the tacos. Okay. I think it's the locomas. I've been waiting for this all day. Look at this. Grasshopper taco. Chapulines. Like grasshoppers throughout the whole thing. Taco de chapulín. We're gonna eat Chapulin. grasshopper tacos right now. So here, here. you ready? You ready? Do I have to uh, take a bite? Take a bite. So we got some cilantro, mm. right? And chapulín. This is the chapulín. Yeah, that's just the grasshopper. Oh my god. Spice. Mm. Why do we never bring up this? Look, I don't like the taste of the chapulín. I personally like it. It's nice and crunchy. You would never know it's an insect. I guess it's because I know what I'm eating exactly. that I didn't like the taste of it that much, but for real, it tastes good. Mm -hmm. It's just me. No. And I'm just too self-aware of what I'm eating. Mmm. And I like the tortilla. It's a black corn, right? Black corn, guacamole, always. Add a bunch of little grasshoppers in there. Mm. I like it a lot. Okay, now I can say for the first time that I ate chapulines. <laughs> Well, that was delicious. We still have one more spot. You ready? Oh my God, one more spot. <laughs> Why are you gonna make me eat? We only have one more place. Unless it's something very exotic, I will try. Or like a steward. One last bite. Oh, I'm so hungry. 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 Oh, I'm so hungry
Hotel Spa and this is one of the oldest establishments on South Beach. Gaston's been working here for 40 years. This place has been here for 60 years. Incredible. So they have a huge menu. I mean, they have numbers, right? It's like, what is this, 63 different items? Um, we're trying to keep it at $10, and I don't really see that many things, but I think we'll probably do something like... Oxtail. No, no, no. No, no, get the oxtail. Oxtail? Yeah, oxtail stew. But that, that's like 25? Mm -hmm. Yep. We're going to do the oxtail stew. It's $25, so it's way out of our budget, but it's okay. This is how it is in South Beach. We told you guys, right? Plus, we're getting two coladas, one each. And cuánto de la colada? Como $100. Más. Hace 30 años. How much is the coladita? Five seventy five. Okay. Tres coladas. Look at this. That's oxtail stew. <laughs> El mejor de Miami también. Sí, no se ve. Here we go, guys. I'm excited. We have the oxtail stew, plus we have the colas. This is like almost like a triple shot, right? And a lot of sugar, again, that's the Cuban style. That is the Cuban style. Col coladita. Colada, coladita. Mm -hmm. So, no, this is the colada, and the coladita is the... And this is good enough to make you hyper the entire day. Ready? Salud. Mm. With that sugar, huh? It's good though. Yeah. One is good for me. So, I don't know if you know this, but I have one of these. I used to have every morning. Before I got, before I got into cold brew, I used to have a glass every single morning. Oh, Nate made it. <laughs> yeah, just the, the sugar, it's just a nice, foamy flavor. Yeah, it's nice. I mean, just basically espresso with lots of sugar. So. And now here we go. Are you ready for this? Okay, oxtail. I love this. Cool. Yeah. And the Italian is called also buco. All right. Let's do this. Pull that out. Cool. A little piece out. Look. So it's a nice piece of meat with some fat. You got the gravy. No. I don't know how you're so skinny. Mm -hmm. Oh, it, it melts. It smells amazing. It melts. Okay. Delicioso esto. Oh, I'm eating this guy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And if you want, you get some of the bread, right? Nice Cuban bread. Oh, the bread Fluffy. is amazing. You see, nice butter. And what I do, what I'm doing is I like dipping it into the gravy. All right? <laughs> get it. Get it. Oh, my God. There you go. Thank you. It's hot. It's super hot. Now the meat. Mm -hmm. so oh my god. And it's very tasty. Mm -hmm. I want to dip it more. Mm. Oh, I can't stop with this meat. You have no idea. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Gravy. And that's it for me. <laughs> and that's it, right? So that. Still super hot. Nice oxtail stew. If you ever have Caribbean food, a lot of oxtail. <laughs> I love doing this. Grab the bone and it's going. Mm -hmm. Where are we going? Right. Sweet plantains. Sweet plantains, ready? Sure. Yeah. Staple Latin America. Mm -hmm. mm. Hola amigo, ¿cómo estás? Muy bien, ¿y tú? David, un placer. Encantado. ¿Sobre mi sueño? Okay, guys, that is it. That is our tour of Cheap Beach or Portable Eats here on South Beach. We have five spots. We wanted to spend roughly $10 at each place. Unfortunately, we never could hit that. Every place was 
between 10 and 15. This is the most expensive. Obviously, we want the oxtail stew. We had to. And here we spend roughly like 40 US. Yeah, okay. but this one was more like a big course. We split everything, right? So. Yes, it was amazing. Well, thank you. No, no problem, no problem. So these are five spots you have to visit when you come to South Beach. Let them know we sent you, and thank you guys so much. I'll see you in the next one.